Hey, Ty Kang with HHS Voice here with Senior Mitchell Friedman. And uh, I have a quick question for you. Would you like there to be a new high school? Uh, yeah, why not? I mean, this one's kind of getting old. I'd love for there to be like new stuff for all the new kids. So it sounds like a great idea. Uh, what specifically would you like to see at the new high school? Uh, air conditioning, uh, a nicer cafeteria, because like, I don't know, buying stuff over here is kind of tough. There's long lines. You know, just newer facilities. As I found senior Hannah Kim right there. I'm going to go interview her. Come on, let's go, let's go. Uh, quick question, would you want there to be a new high school for younger generations? Yes. Uh, nice. Uh, is there anything specific you'd like to see in the new high school? Like, like new facilities, like bigger spaces? <laughs> log scheduling. I think log scheduling would be a really good idea. Um, maybe like an up, like an upstairs like garden, like an high school oh. musical, something like that. I, shout out Troy Bullen. A better senior courtyard. Ty Kang back. Uh, we had current junior Kylie Klinski here. Nice to see you. Uh, what would you like there to be a new high school in the future? No. No. I am current senior class president since freshman year, uh, Connor Leone. Uh, Connor, I have a quick question for you. I understand that you're graduating this year, but would you want there to be a new high school for the upcoming uh, kids? Um. It does seem like our current facilities and infrastructure is starting to fail. Uh, in terms of tax dollars, probably would raise locally. Yeah, uh, that brings up a valid point, but uh, is there anything specific you would want to see in the new high school? Um, I'd like to see better facilities around athletically. I think the fact that the basketball team has to share and come in late, it, it really hurts academically. Something, though, that is a concern is the fact that we did just get this new turf and the fact that we might be getting new facilities, like, just giving that to the school, I don't know. I understand your concerns. Thank you uh, for your opinion, I'm going to walk by. Yo, what is up, boys? It's Ty back from another interview. I got current senior, Luke Ackle, a really cute kid. Uh, I have a quick question for you, Luke. Would you want a new high school to be built for younger generations? No, I had to suffer with this with the high school, so they should suffer too. Uh, hey guys, it's Ty, and I have Miss Weller here, uh, one of the most favorite teachers for student body. Uh, Probably not true. My favorite teacher. I never, I never had him. Uh, this good. This makes good. it easier for me to be the favorite. Uh, would you want there to be a new high school in the future? Yes, yes, I would. Uh, what is something uh, specific that you would want to see implemented into the new building? Um, into the new building, I would like to see specifically, since I'm looking at it right now, a cafeteria or a meeting space that's large enough mm -hmm. to um, have all of the students be able to have lunch comfortably. Um, so that there isn't like the giant lunch period that we have, for example, period six, where I think there are 800 kids in there. Also, I would like to have a space that's large enough that would allow us to be able to manipulate our schedule a little bit differently, perhaps to have block scheduling, or to be able to have rotating block or rotating drop scheduling, something so that it would free us up from the confines that we have of having to have split lunches or the 25 minute lunch period. Thank you. Yo, it's your boy Ty back with another interview. I have current senior Alec here with me. Uh, Alec, would you want a new high school to be built? Honestly, no. We don't need to build another high school. This one's good enough for us. This one's good? All right. Uh, thank you. Hey, it's Ty Kang with The Boys. I'm here with Lara, uh, a current sophomore at HHS. And uh, would you want a new high school to be built? Yeah, okay. Yeah, uh, what would, what's something specific you'd like to see in the new high school? Um, kind of just like the same school spirit. Same school spirit? Like maybe a little bigger? Like it's crowded. bigger, it's yeah, like I way too you. crowded in here. Yo, it's Kang Bang back with another interview. Uh, I have two current freshmen, Dabri to my right and Sophia to my left. Uh, guys, quick questions for you guys. Um, would you guys want a new high school to be built? I'll start with you. Yeah. Yeah? All right. Not really. Not really? How come? I don't know, I feel like, I feel like this school, like, to be all together. Yo, what's up guys? We're in the Tech Hub right now. 
Uh, I got current senior Dante Walker. He's a tech hover here. Uh, I have a quick question for you. Uh, would you like there to be a new high school built for younger generations? Of course I would. I think that our, our high school high school right now is a little old, so if we had some updates, it would be nicer for the future generation. Uh, what's something specific you'd like to see implemented into the new building? Um, a little bit bigger classrooms and probably nicer gym space and locker room space for athletes. Shh, yo, we're in the library right now. Ty Gang with the voice. Let's go interview these three groups of kids. I got current junior Justin and uh, two seniors, Tara and Allison. Guys, do you, would you want there to be a new high school built for the kids? I think it would be great if a new high school was built. <laughs> Sounds good. Sounds good. Uh, I said for younger generations, if you listen to my question. Doesn't matter to me. Obviously, has no heart over here, so I'll ask you two. Uh, what is something specific you guys like to see in the new high school? A pool, so we can have some Olympic swimmers. <laughs> Back to you, bro. <laughs> hey guys, we're still at the library right now, and I'm going to interview one of the most uh, well-known people here in mm -hmm. HHS history. Uh, 